why don't I take the chain guard off of my fat bike? So here's the story behind that. So the bike I bought, the fat bike, obviously when I bought it, it wasn't taken care of very good. It sat outside, the chain was rusty, and it wasn't in great shape. Now I do a lot of flipping bikes, and I buy the bikes, and they have pretty crappy condition. I just need someone to make the chain or the parts relive again and live enough to sell the bike and not have to dump a bunch of money into it. So with this bike, same deal, the chain was all rusty. I use a pretty heavy penetrating f lubricant in it. With that being said, that lubricant is very wet. And it stays wet for a long time, but it lubricates all the little joints, gets pretty much all that rust out, and gets everything moving back like it should again. Now, normally I'd wash the bike. Problem is, I bought this bike, it was already too cold to have my hose on outside, so I'm able to wash it. So, with that being said, this chain guard is probably gonna stay until that chain goes away, which will probably be pretty soon because I'm re-gearing the bike. Haha, -ha, sneak peek for you. So, chain guard will go away, but that's why chain lube I have on there currently is really wet and I don't want to get on my pant lights when I ride.